show you how you can freeze a column or a row in Google Sheets. So what that means is that sometimes you might have multiple sections in your Google Sheets like I do here. If I scroll across, uh, there's more to read. And why this tool or this feature is so amazing is because it keeps one particular column frozen in place. So I really want to keep tracking my students' names, but as I scroll across, they disappear. So this feature is really great for keeping it in place so that I can still see who I would be marking or reporting or um, commenting against. So how you do that is first you select your column and make sure it's selected so it's all blue here or grey. I'm going to come up to view, I'm going to click freeze and then I'm going to come down to a one column because I've selected a column. Now the same rules would apply for a row um, or two rows or two columns. So I'm just going to click one column. It's then going to freeze it in place, so it looks a little bit different to how it did before. It's sort of like more prominent on the left. I can then scroll across now, and it's showing that my students' names are actually kept in place. So I don't have to scroll back or forth and think, oh my gosh, whose name have I got here? I can scroll across, and I can actually check it or fill in information against the person's name um, along the far columns on the right. So that's really handy for keeping it in place. You can do this with rows, you could do this with multiple columns, uh, and it's under the view freeze section.